seed. In angiosperms, the seed is the final product of sexual reproduction. It is often described as a fertilized ovule. Seeds are formed inside fruits. A seed typically consists of seed coat, cotyledons, and an embryonal axis. The cotyledons of the embryo are simple structures, generally thick and swollen due to storage of food reserves, as in legumes. Mature seeds may be non-albuminous or albuminous. Non-albuminous seeds have no residual endosperm as it is completely consumed during embryo development. Example, pea, groundnut. Albuminous seeds retain a part of endosperm as it is not completely used up during embryo development. Example, wheat, maize, barley, castor and sunflower. Occasionally, in some seeds, such as black pepper and beet, remnants of nucellus are also present. This residual persistent nucellus is the perisperm. A true seed is a fertilized mature ovule that possesses an embryonic plant, stored food, sometimes absent, and a protective coat or coats. However, in a popular sense, the term seed is also applied to single-seeded dry fruits like caryopsis of cereals, cypsella of the asteraceae members, etc., and the vegetative propagules, bulbous pieces of potato, tubers, etc. Following fertilization, growth sets in various parts of the ovule, resulting into a seed. The zygote develops into the embryo. A seed is a base structure of an ovule with some parts lost and some new ones developed. It is seldom that all the ovules in an ovary mature into seeds. For example, in cherry and almond, there are two ovules per ovary, but regularly only one matures into seed. Occasionally, however, both may develop 